Hey, can you just hold it for a second, please? Boss, you got a visitor. Oh, yeah? That's who it is. Okay. Sorry about that. I didn't know who you were. I won't make that mistake again. Justin here. Hey, what's cracking? So what you think about all this? Shit, we looking good, right? Look, this is our business. You feel me? You put the bread down, shit, you the owner. I'm the manager. Franklin Clinton, dawg. And that over there is my old ass homie Chop. Shit, he don't get around too much no more. Man, everybody I asked about setting this thing up, they all pointed straight at you. A genuine, real reputable. Now me? Shit, I'm a hustler that made it big. Big house, nice cars, a family, and everything. But damn, man, I miss getting these fucking hands dirty. And from what I hear, you ain't got that problem. You run your own shit, and I like that. Hey, look, come walk with me. I want to show you something. Now the streets, I know real good, because that's where I'm from. But now I work with rich folk who got rich folk problems and no fucking idea how to deal with them. You know, like the kid might stole a car, or they might owe money to the wrong fucking people, or their wife might be screwing the tennis coach. But guess what? My homies can help them with all that. Now this here, this is your office. I'm going to get all these jobs for us, and they're going to show up on this computer right here. It'll be small fry at first, but one big client, man. One A-list name, and we straight. Hey, that's our hacker right there, Imani. And she works up on the operation floor where all the high-tech shit at. Oh, shit. Hey, Imani. Man, these kids, man. Knock, knock, my politically incorrect racial epithets. What that shit do? What are you doing here, Lamar? No, nah, the question is, what are you doing here? Is that who you bringing in with you? Why you didn't tell me? I'm the one who called that pimp, put him up on everything, dawg. And you motherfuckers got the nerve to cut me out? Well, I got two words for y'all. Finders, motherfucking feet. That's right, I'm gonna sue y'all ass. Matter of fact, I'm gonna blast y'all asses out on Snapmatic. Where my phone? Man, at? hold oh, on, shit. dawg. Man, I was gonna look out for you. Chill out, all right? Shit, I got something here. Dog, come on. Ah, uh, nah, put that shit away. I'm part of San Andreas's budding cannabis scene. I remember this dude when he was broke as fuck. Could barely get a motherfucking coach seat. Now all of a sudden, eating grapes in the cockpit with the captain. Look at you. And you, I ain't even finna go in on your dog ass, cause you know what's happening, but I ain't tripping. Cause now, it's LD's turn to come up. How's that for a sample? Okay, I see you. I get this some good shit. You damn straight. That's that pie gal. All right. Hey, you get going on those. I'll be in my office, all right? Right. Hey, who is that badass little fist looking bitch? I, I mean, nice young lady with the profitable posterior right there. Nigga, that's Imani. That's Pearly, nigga, the homegirl's daughter. She handle all our hacker type shit. Ooh, that's Pearly daughter. I should have known. She hacking this shit too? I ain't even know they had a computer. Damn, I feel old. Tell me about it. You get going on those jobs, I'm gonna go work on this big client for us, all right? Wait, wait. You mean big, big client like Tony McTony? Come on, man. Tell me you got Tony McTony. Ah, oh, see if Tony McTony will post my weed on this page, man. You got me, Frank? Come on, man. Whatever I got going, man, you got going, so I'm gonna look out for you. Hey, I'll be in my office. You keep doing what you're doing. Man, he be lying like a motherfucker. Anyway, though, now look at you. You feel like somebody now, huh? You OG now. Your nuts is almost big as mine. But they won't be. Not at all. Hey, what's up? I got you on this communicator thing, and I can see what your ass doing on the screen. So no creepy shit, all right? Now, like I said before, I'm a hustler who made it. 
I got in with a crew of dudes with some real experience. They taught me how to operate on a serious level. No more hood shit for me, you know what I'm saying? That's why we got a setup like this. Hey, look, click on the security contract page and check that shit out. Hey, so look, these the jobs we got right now. After the guys showed me how to make moves, we pulled a big-ass scope, and I cashed out. I was making investments, you know, other plays, and doing real good, but none of that shit hit right. And then I figured I should use my motherfucking street knowledge with these contacts, and that's the business right there. I'm a fixer to the rich and famous, but you can only go so far alone, you know what I'm saying? So I needed a grade-A partner with grade-A capital and grade-A skills. Someone to help me turn my hustle into a major operation. And so here we are. These clients ain't exactly A-list, but now that we working together, shit, it won't be long before we get some of those. But look, for now, the work is robberies, recoveries, assassinations, rescues, and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? Once you find a job you like, select it here. Then Imani and me will start moving on our side. And hey, I appreciate you want to keep a low profile. That's why my name is on the door, and I'm the face of this shit. You know what I'm saying? So I'm working the contacts, and you moving in the streets. Some of these can be real tricky, homie, but I'll let you know. And I'll make sure the fucking payout is worth it. Sounds good? All right, while well, I get working on the A-list catch, somebody who will put us on the damn map. Hey, I wish I could get that girl on them billboards. Uh, Rosalia. But shit, man, I don't think her ass in enough trouble right now to need us. At least not yet. But we aiming high, homie. Everything okay? Hey, listen up. You know the Dale Peril Plaza? Yeah, that fine dining place over on Bay City Avenue, where the owner's a client of ours, and I just got off the phone with him. Turns out his restaurant is one of the biggest money laundering fronts in the city, but he got a problem. Yeah, so Kane Powerful was running a new counterfeiting ring, and that's bad for business. You know who needs money laundering if you can print the shit for free? He needs us to figure out where the fuck they at and burn their shit down. I say tell one of their helicopters and see where the fuck they hide.
Hey. Hey. You ever wonder what Amani would look like if she wasn't in all that hard ass goth shit? Where can I get you? Now it's small, but it packs enough juice to knock even the big dogs out. Yeah, I feel that. We ain't gotta kill them all, I guess. Ooh, that's nice. Guaranteed to scare the shit out of just about anyone. Let's go. I can't wait to see this thing in action. Always gotta have a mag of that. Yup. Gotta load up before you head out. Keep your eyes open. <laughs> 